Slim Jim Longfoot Slim Jim Longfoot Yo, what's up, world? It's your man, Slim Jim Longfoot, a.k.a. the GOAT, King of America. Welcome to day 14, 15 of Diabetes and Not. The daily vlog series that I do to show y'all how to combat this type 2 diabetes with the one, two, you feel me? Yo, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe down below. Hit that notification bell so you can keep up on all things Slim Jim Longfoot, such as my product reviews, my how-to videos for YouTubers, my TV and movie reviews, my reactions, my video clips, my, um, my daily, uh, my live streams, my daily vlogs that you're watching right now, and last but not least, my art video series, GOAT1408 TV, which dropped a new episode last night. If you had not checked that out yet, what you waiting on? Go do that there. Uh, shout outs to the members of the live chat crew. Uh, most notable members includes um, Avi Gavaga, the Greek Goddess, Sexy Trees, 1408, Queen Candace, Michael Marshall, Life's Magical Journey, Wellness with Frugal Mama, and last but not least, my sis, the big sis of YouTube, Latanya Porter. Special consideration to my bro, Johnny Quest Gaming, who co-hosts the Nerd Strip Club with me. You ain't checked that out channel yet. What you waking on? What you waking on? What you waking on? Go do that there. Go do that there. Go do that there. All right? And also, shout out to the members of the 1408, which includes Kid Wonders, Life of Wonder, Gaming Mode, Advice with Mel, Elevate with Vern, Blackjack939, Crow Loan, and last but not least, Eat to Live Strong. If you yourself would like to be a member of the 1408, you're going to have to wait a little minute until we get back monetized here on the channel. If you truly want to support Slim Jim Longfoot and all my endeavors, check out the links in the description below, which includes uh, the books I have written, the books I have drawn, the merchandise that I have, and last but not least, my sister's cash app on behalf of my awesome niece, Paris, who was shot on the 2nd of uh, February back in 2022. Hashtag Paris Strong, hashtag Paris for Paris, whether that's F-O-R or the number four, Paris with two R's. Uh, today is the 17th of January. 2024 Ali Bumbaye Ali Bumbaye Ali Bumbaye Today is the 82nd excuse me yeah 82nd birthday 82nd um anniversary of the birth of Muhammad Ali born Cassius Marcellus Clay Jr. back on this date in 1942 uh it'll be 8 years this year since he passed um back in 2016 uh, regarded as one of the greatest um, fighters, one of the greatest athletes in history. Um, this year marks 60 years. It marks 60 years this year since 22 year old Cassius Clay won the heavyweight championship and of course afterwards, not too long afterwards, um, changed his name, you know, to align with his faith, um, his, his Islamic faith, um, to Muhammad Ali. Um, the greatest, the greatest to ever do it truly the goat being a capricorn and he truly was a goat you feel me so happy birthday to the goat you feel me all day every day also today um today is also the birthday of the first um <clears throat> um first lady of african descent uh, michelle obama michelle robinson obama was born on this date as well um, if I'm not mistaken, um, was, was it 64 or 65? Let me, let me, uh, clarify real quick and, um, get, get that info, which, uh, for y'all real quick. Cause I, if her birthday was, if, if I'm not mistaken, if she was born in 64, then that means she is 60 years old today. Or I believe she was born in, yep, yep, today, yep, she was born in 64. So today is her 60th birthday, y'all. Shout outs to Michelle Obama, who turned 60 today. She, of course, was the first lady of the United States from um, 2009 to 2017. Um, you know, her husband, of course, Barack Obama, was elected back in 2008 and sworn in in 2009. And, of course, their last um, day as uh, president and first lady was um, the 20th of January back in 2017 when the next guy, you know, became, you know, got sworn in. So... So yeah, so shout outs to uh, Michelle Obama, 60 years old today. Um, yep, yep, yep. So that part. Um, and also, also on this date, also on this date, um, Betty White. Betty White's birthday 
is today uh she was born uh 102 years ago y'all just that quick y'all 102 years ago it wasn't that long ago we was talking about her turning 100 but she died on the last day of 2021 at the age of 99 17 days before her birthday uh betty white was born 102 years ago on today's date in 1922 january 17th 1922 um one amongst many legends who was born in the year 1922 um people that you might not think of think of but if you want to see the majority of them i have a video here on my page showcasing the celebs that was born in 1922 because that was a loaded year of celebrities that was born that year from betty white to stan lee red fox dorothy dandridge and so many more including the only one who is still alive to this day in 2024 um jackie robinson's uh widow uh rachel robinson who is still alive in 2024 y'all um so she will be 102 years old this year wild wild um rest in peace uh to betty white rest in peace to muhammad ali and happy 60th birthday to michelle obama um so yeah and we loaded baby you know it's goat season baby and shout outs to whoever you are watching this in the future that is born today whoever is being born right now on january 17th 2024 in the year 2044 when you're 20 years old hopefully you might get this recommended on youtube and be like hey that that guy was shouting me out the day i was born you know you know shouting you out the day you was born you know and that that's what i'm gonna have to start doing i'm gonna have to start shocking out everybody who's being born on whatever day that it is because it's somebody being born every day is somebody dying every day and you know it might not be dying or being born physically it might be dying and being born on a mental level you know what I'm saying? You're being reborn each and every day to do better than you did yesterday. You feel me? So that's what it's all about. We are manifesting greatness on every level. Manifesting and maintaining greatness on every level. On that spiritual level. On that mental level. On that emotional level. On that physical level. On that financial level. That's what we're doing, baby. Manifesting and maintaining greatness. You feel me? That's what we're doing. All day, every day. Yeah, you know I mean, with the dread beers and all that there. Ding, 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 ding. Anyway, but um, but yeah, that's that's what we're doing, baby. Let me bring that down, so uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, but um, yeah, that's 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 what we bees at, man. That's what we bees at. So it's right now, currently, as I talk to y'all, it's 11:30 in the morning. Um, I am about to check my blood sugar. I try to check my blood sugar at least three times a day before breakfast, before lunch, and before dinner. Uh, I got my salad over here. Got me another um, salad that I made. Oh, yeah, I forgot to write down what I had last night. Um, I had uh, pork chops and mashed potatoes. And what I had last night. Pork. Oh. Potatoes with cheese. Yeah. That was good too, baby. So yeah, I just uh I just uh uploaded two shorts uh while I was sitting here talking to y'all. Shout out to Two Short, the rapper. Um but uh yeah, so we got two shorts. I know um they're 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 brand new, so I know nobody's gonna respond in them between now and you know the end of this uh daily vlog so of course i will talk about them again you know mention them again tomorrow uh you know if anybody comes through or whatnot like that but um anywho i hope once again everybody is having the most awesome day i'm not gonna hold y'all too long today because hey it's hump day it's hump day it's hump day baby it's wednesday which means i'm another week older for those that don't know i was born on a wednesday so i'm another week older you know what I'm saying? Um, what two hours and two hours and um, 16 minutes ago, I turned the week older. Yep, 9:16 in the morning. So two hours and 16 minutes ago, I became another week older. Yeah, 
you know it, it, it's a trip you know when you look at the passage of time and how you know at first you know we're going by your baby being days old then weeks old then months old i never get i never really get how i, I get i guess it's a two-year grace period i guess you could say when people like you know how old is your baby oh my baby's 17 months like your baby's a year old like you know after 12 months it's a year old you ain't got to keep doing months but you know i don't know you know that's 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 weird to me you know after you turn a year old you know you're a year old but you know i guess people want to say you know my baby's um 22.5 months old like what your baby your baby almost two just just say your baby almost two <laughs> you ain't gotta do all that but i don't know but knowing how I be calculating, I'm probably going to do the same thing. I mean, you see how I be calculating. I'm going to be like, yeah, my baby is um, 500 months old. Three weeks. <laughs> in two days. <laughs> like, what? I mean, shoot. I'm definitely not going to be saying it by the time my kid 500 months old. Because I don't know if y'all don't know, but... Let's see, it wasn't that long ago I turned 500 months old. Wait, when did I turn 500 months old? Let me look. Yeah, I actually wrote it down. Because it wasn't that long ago. I think it was last year, either last year or the year before. Um, yeah, in 2022, uh, August 24th, 2022, I turned 500 months old. So, <laughs> so, so, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Crazy. So, It'll be a while till my kid turn 500 months old. First, I gotta conceive him. So, that part. That part. But, um, once again, I hope everybody's having the most awesome day, the most great day. And with that being said, like I said, I'm not gonna hold y'all too long. Um, I'm about to check my blood sugar. You know what I'm saying? That's, you know, behind the whole basis of these daily vlog series. For those that are new here, you know what I'm saying? I started these daily vlogs because you know your boy almost died and therefore i wanted to chronicle my journey to eating better living better and all that good stuff although i was there mentally you know what i'm saying i just wasn't there physically as far as you know really taking care of myself as i should you know and though those are the things that we you know what I'm saying you know the most the the worst thing that you can ever do in your life is neglect yourself you know what i'm saying it's, it's it's bad enough to neglect somebody else but to neglect yourself that's that's the ultimate form of disrespect because nobody is going to love you like you supposed to love yourself nobody is going to believe in you like you're supposed to believe in yourself you know what i'm saying you got to take all of your energies to make yourself better you know what i'm saying because nobody ain't gonna like like for instance you know what I'm saying? If if you walking down the street and you funky as crap, you know what I'm saying? You just stink. You know what I'm saying? Most people ain't going to walk up to you and say, hey, man. Hey, come on over, man. You know, you need to take a bath and get, and get some fresh clothes on. You know what I'm saying? Nobody ain't going to walk up to you and say that. They're going to walk by or look at you. They're going to smell you and be like, oh, I got to get the away from here. Cause this dude is foul. He is disgusting. He is foul. This chick, oh, she smell like a whole f um seafood shop. Oh no, it has to get away. You feel me? Nobody is going to care about you on that level. Because if you ain't caring about yourself, how you expect somebody else to care about you? You know. And so that's why you got to put your energy. You got to put the love that you have within you and give it to yourself first give it to yourself first and then you can expand upon everybody else you know what i'm saying i i can't i can't help you if i ain't got money to help myself you feel me you know like that and you know case, case in point you know on, on situations and which is why anybody who can help me and anybody who i can help i appreciate and i love to do wholeheartedly because if i had millions of dollars right now man it'd be so many people i know cash apps lacking up or whatever type of you know what i'm saying financial thing they got going on it'd be it'd be on and popping 
it be on and popping. You know what I'm saying? If you know, you know. So, you know, that part. But, um, but yeah, I just got through checking my blood sugar. You know what I'm saying? And, um, like, like I say, you know, the goal was to stay on top of that. The goal was to stay on top of that and, um, keep doing what I'm doing on that tip because nobody else going to do it. You know what I'm saying? I can't, nobody else ain't going to say, Hey, you know, did you do that or whatnot like that? If somebody do, it's definitely appreciated because you know, that means that you care about a goat. Other than that, I don't expect you to because that's something that I got to do and deal with. And so at the, at the same time, like I say, you got to put that love into yourself. You got to believe in yourself and you got to make it do what it do. And if you're around like-minded people, then you ain't never alone because, you know, those people going to care about you and love you um, the same way that you do in a sense because they know what it means to care about themselves and they have a lot of love and they have a lot of love to care about others. You feel me? Because like I said, you know what I'm saying? Loving yourself first isn't being selfish, but only loving yourself is being selfish. You feel me? It's a difference between loving yourself first and only loving yourself. You feel me? If you feel me, drop the hunting emoji down. If you got this far, drop the 100 emoji down. That part. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is time for the shout out, shout out, shout out. Hey, 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 shout out, shout out, shout out. Hey, hey, hey. It's time for the shout outs, baby. It's time for the shout outs, baby. I have been loving this uh, manoir that I've been reading, Solo Leveling, which just recently been adapting into an animated series. Um, it is freaking awesome. Um, okay, so far um, I see I see some um, somebody left a comment on one of the shorts that I had just posted already. The show is to watch out for in 2024. Yo, 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 um, let's see. Who left a comment there? Uh, Latanya Porter said, "Thank you, bro, bro. You're welcome, sis." Hey, that part on the show is to watch out for in 2024. Comment has already been left, and um, let's see. Here we go. Yesterday's uh, episode of Goat 1408 TV dropped yesterday with my art muse Kimberly Sargent uh, for episode 193. We got. Kimberly Sargent herself, she uh, left the purple heart and the heart eyes emoji. Hey, that part. Latanya Porter said, hey, bro, bro, what's up, sis? <laughs> Excuse me. Johnny Quest Gaming said, beautiful. Hey, appreciate it, bro. Now, let's see. Who was here for the uh, live chat of that? Who was here in the live chat for that episode? Uh... Uh, Sexy Treese was in the building and Latanya Porter was in the house. Hey, that part. Shout outs to uh, them for sliding through yesterday on the um, on the uh, episode of Goat 1408 TV. Um, and y'all stay tuned because the next episode is going to be dope. Hopefully, my iPad don't act stupid and not record <laughs> my art. But uh, Naisha B, aka Naisha Baker, is my next muse let me let me get y'all to count down to who is next on the um, list we got naisha b is my muse for episode 194 of goat 1408 tv uh 195 brandy mercedes who is a content creator here on youtube she is my muse for episode 195 alasia alasia um a young woman who is a singer promising singer you know what I'm saying? Up and coming singer. She is my muse for episode 196 of GOAT 1408 TV. Uh, Faye. Faye, the captain of the best team at, 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 a, at a stadium that I know very well, is my muse for episode 197. Uh, the young lady by the name of Desiree. She is my muse for episode 198 of GOAT 1408 TV. Sweet juicy, sweet juicy. 
Sweet Juicy's After Leisure Life, aka the Queen of Candyland. She is my muse for episode 199 of GOAT 1408 TV. And last but not least, um, Christine Hamid, aka Aunt Chris, is my muse for episode 200 of GOAT 1408 TV, which is already here on the channel. So y'all make sure y'all check out those episodes as we make our way up to episode 200 of goat 1408 tv that is crazy episode 200 man that's wild and it's that's 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 wild with it man that's wild with it so um so yeah that's that's where we at baby that's where we at and so now yesterday's daily vlog day 1414 here we go um we have no comments in the regular comment section and let's see who was here in the live chat. In the live chat, who was here yesterday? We had Sexy Trees 1408 in the live chat. And Life's Magical Journey was there as well. And boom, that was it. You know, once again, I appreciate all y'all for showing up and showing out. If you are here today watching this thing today, I appreciate you. Whether you watching this in the live chat or if you watching this in the replay, in the in the playback, laid back, way back, in the playback, made back, you dig? Now, nothing else to say other than if you're keeping up with me on the exercise challenges, that's what's up. I dropped my 100 today on day 17, you know, 13 more days to go. Let's get it. Let's get it, get it, get it. All right. Ugh. Video. Playlist. Watch them all, all right? One love.